Mike is cheap, put money where your mouth is. Loudest, get the ouches. My call beat down is the phallus. No B3, I need a first to ten. Put in reps, tell it hurts to bend. The best ever, put your nerve to bend. Serve him to a nervous wreck. Churches bless, send souls to heaven. Bodies laid on a stretcher. Yes, that's a rival series. Fellow boomers, check the time. Teach you guys how to lay a beating. Yeah, this is rival series. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, but especially those over 30, much like the 1993 family film featuring dinosaurs, we're back. And now we're better than ever. As of yesterday, we are Twitch affiliates, which means the polls are coming and the FGCB community can develop a crippling addiction to gambling while tuning into the finest old folks fighting games on the web. As always, my name is Pap Turt, a.k.a. Paper T, a.k.a. Five Days from a Character Crisis, and I am joined, as always, by my partner in crime, the walking frame data tool. He's the sensei that friends say can lend a helping hand to those in need. He'll show you your mistakes that'll cut you no breaks, and he only cries at Chun-Li's thighs. Jimenez, 357. Today, we're bringing you two, count them, two Rivals matches. We have the internal struggle and secret lore match of Counterweight's Ryu taking on Depth Monk's Kage. Will the Beast feast, or will Ryu secure the conclusion that SF6 requires? Afterwards, we'll be taking you to Mayoral Mayhem, as Stone steps up to the plate against Hamon Beat, the Akuma specialist, and one of the most clipped players I've had the privilege to watch in tourney. Stay tuned for the ragingest of demons. Jimmy, before I let you talk, I do have a quick shout-out from Kuma. Our beloved Kuma wrote a message she wanted to read prior to the event today. It goes as follows. Hello, all bo boomers! and viewers from Japan. I want to say thank you all to all the viewers. Your support is very important. You will have the pleasure to watch two boomers cross fists this day. And today's match will be a battle for control of space and pacing. Introducing our two competitors, Deft Monk, the scientist, a player who lives in the lab. When you are in casual matches or watching others, he is in the lab. When you are eating and resting, he is in the lab. Rumors say he was created in a lab as an experiment. A player with strong execution, he favors characters who have strong mix-up options. There is a high chance he will lay some, land some crazy mix you have never seen before. With the power of Kage in his hands, he can be an overwhelming force. His opponent, Counterweight, a player who expresses himself through his style. Soul and passion come together when Counterweight enters the arena. He has an iron will and the spirit of a samurai. Just like his character, he's here for the fight. With a strong neutral and a powerful fireball game, he can win any matchup. Few players can show the ring of Ryu like Counterweight can. Can Def Monk close the distance and impose Kage's rushdown to use his mix-up options? Will Counterweight be able to control the pace of the match and use his fundamentals to finish? Let's find out words from Kuma's corner. Jimmy, how are you, sir? Doing well. Just, uh, you know, just making sure everything, you know, is working behind the scenes properly, and now I'm ready to go. Let's send it into action. All right, let's do it. Let's get these uh, games underway. Uh, let's do a poll. Because <laughs> we can, I think. The simplest of polls, right? Uh-huh. It's going to be just a very who do you think is going to win because we are learning live. If Spooky's in the chat, he can be my hero. He can take point on this. Did he do it all right? He's so good. You know, I'm actually going to close the chat on my desktop. And I'll maybe pull it up on my phone. <laughs> That way I'm Are not... you not a mod, Spooky? That's messed up. Okay, I'll get it. I got it. I think you can make him a mod. I could be mistaken, though. He's like way more of a mod than I am. That's whack. Type in forward dash mod, I think, and then username. I think you can do it. I could be mistaken. I think you might need to have higher powers, though. Alright, I am... Whoa, 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 Who? Okay, we're learning. As 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 per Boomer tradition, we do this live and we figure it out. Boom! I understand that the mods who have voted will not be able to choose the outcome, okay? <laughs> Thanks, Twitch, for keeping me honest. The poll is up. Who will emerge victorious? Wager your Boomer coins. How do I predict? I'm not... In the chat, it should be at the top oh, of the office. I see, I predict. see. It. Okay. All right, my money's in. Get those coins a-wagered. I've learned that I can't wager, lest I corrupt the system, which is my passion. Wow, this Kage costume. Coming out stylish today. Also, shout-outs to my balls, Itch. Wish he had a different name, but what a phenomenal team. But we are underway. 
exchange with fireballs. Counter with the early lead. A lot of jumping. These players both very, very separate technical players on Super Bowl Sunday. Oh, yeah. Who said that in the chat? That was beautiful. Stone saxophone. Shout out. Oh, there's the knowledge check right there. So one thing to keep in mind about this matchup is you want to recognize what stomp is Kage doing there, right? Um, the heavy stomp is the one that's plus on block, and then the medium stomp is the one that frames traps, but it's a uh, safe on block. So counterweight, we'll see if counterweight uh, adjusts to that strategy to see if he knows the matchup here. Oh, uh, this is a really good spot for counterweight. Oh no, he can just try to bait out a DP there. In a powerful place. Here is Deathmonk taking an early lead. Spooky, I'm gonna have to give you a mod later, bro. I'm sorry. I'm too slow. I'll figure it out. <laughs> you know the rules. Hey, oh, quick shout out to the sub in the chat. Geometry Tree with the tier one sub. Appreciate you. Who own a tick? Sub before the stream even started. Back to the action. Oh, misses the meaty uh, stomp there. I think we're stomp on somebody to get up last second. Also, I appreciate the stage. What a dramatic show to I know, right? Ryu and the inner demons. These inner demons holding a little bit of frames here. That was a good neutral jump from Counterway, but he missed the anti-air, though. It's probably gonna hurt. Oh my god. Spends it. Oh, was that gonna hit? Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my god, oh, that was dirty. No. I got hit by that. That was nasty. I got smoked by that. Damn. I got oh, hit by that. Deftmonk. Deftmonk taking the secret tech out in the very first game. The filth that was vile. Spooky saying that was evil. Voted for Deftmonk. He knew. He knew this man has the inside tech. How will our hero, Johnny Street Fighter, recover? I think that was an oopsie poop oh, yeah. on MVP. Or the hardest to breathe. Yeah. One thing, I was going to say, we're about to say the same thing. Stop frame data, is, you will learn it. You will learn it live, because otherwise you hold that forever. Great DP answer. One, one thing that Counterweight can do, actually, is if he can react to it in time, he can actually parry the, the heavy stomp and then punish him for it. That's one thing I like to do with Cody, is to crime slay it when, he, when, he's coming, uh, when he's coming down with the stomp, and I'm able to punish uh, Kage. Your words to Counterweight's ears. He hears the first parry to implement it. Back to life. Oh my play. god, that's what I'm talking about! <laughs> Wrong situation, but it still works out. Oh, catches the fireball there. Doesn't get the cross with the Ixatsu. Oh. Holy crap, the fists are flying. This set is wild so far. All right, Spook, you can, we'll, we'll give you mod later. Points first. Feeling it out. Air fireball. Didn't make approaching a little hard for counterweight. Oh, good knockdown with the EX fireball. Get some real estate here. Plus frames there. Oh, there it is. Oh, That's what woo! I was talking about. Oh, that's a hype parry. Oh, yeah. Spends a little oh. meter. I don't want to hold this. Great jump. From oh, what a block on the overhead. One thing to keep in mind is the EX version of that stomp is an overhead. It's the only version that's an overhead. Oh, what a cross cut. That's good. Wow, this is, this is high. Oh, yeah. Action. Holy cow. They're swinging for the fences here. Oof. Good stuff there by Death Monk. Counterweight came out strong in that first round. Laying down in the grass, a deep breath, preparing himself. Parry those. Oh yeah, that's actually a uh, really good strategy there from, um, from Counterweight. If you parry those fireballs, you just gain more V-meter for your uh, for your V-trigger. Get it sooner. Man, you can see the little adaptations already with when the jump is coming into play. You get mm. to read for those fireballs. Also, hello, after good afternoon. Welcome to a hype set. Holding some stomps. I want to see that more of that parry. Yeah, I don't want to see a sick here. option. Oh, that's a punish. Oh, but doesn't get it. Oh, we let those rip. Oh, that cross is going to hurt. He might hurt. Not quite. Oh, that's probably going to chip. Be reversal. Be reversal. Do oh, doesn't quite get the be reversal in time. Wow, that's a lot of pressure. I feel like Carly Counterweight wins. starting to make a pretty significant series of adaptations, but the smothering damage from Death Bug. Your journey ends here. Actually, there's at least eight games to go.
Def Monk, a KOF player who crossed the bridge over to Street Fighter Town, has very strongly adapted. Fundies is fundies, my friends. Patience from Counterweight here. Oh, yeah. Gets across it, but ends up trading. That's minus there from that distance. Nice like for him. Oh, a little bit early on the meaty. Oh, gets caught teching there. That's gonna hurt. I think stuns to be a real problem here. Oh yeah. Oh. That, with the right combo, that might do it. Oh, not quite. Just shy. Maybe EX would have done it. A huge strength. Uh, Death Monk has been the confirm so far. He gets, he gets a nice confirm into two resets in that game. But don't. Oh, we're spending it. That's a very active choice if you're playing as Kage because you get to make like four mistakes. Right. The character is made of, of just willpower, hope, and the grass he stands amongst. A little late on the DP to see the attempt comes from Counterweight. Uh, gets caught with that frame trap or the, the plus frames again. Ah, uh, the cross oh. that was dirty. Stun's a real problem yes, now. Just... Oh, same situation again. Gets caught low. Uh oh, he's looking at seven golden letters in his near future here. No BTB rules here. Oh. It still counts as one Tiny game. mistake. B ship, an interesting option. Spends it, takes the frames. Respect, oh. doesn't go for the DP. Oh! Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> Good cross up there by Death Monk. Way to keep his now, composure there. Counterweight had an absolutely stellar cross cut DP earlier to cover that kind of cross up option. I'm hoping he can sneak some more of those into your Death Monk. Really leaning into those cross ups and doing a brilliant job with them. I've, man, you can feel the pressure as soon as you're holding down back against this character. Oh, yeah. Round one. Fight. Spends the parry. Oh, no. Good old honest fireball war. I might be Except an honest. I was going to say, I feel like. Um, classic. Classic rush. Oh, no! Bad spot for right now. Man, really, really fun to watch Death Monk here. He's mixing his options up a ton. Oh, yeah. Not on the same. Oh, oh there it is. It that good time. parry. Doesn't get oh. the DP though. It's okay. That was good damage. He's out of the corner now. Oh, that's minus there. That was the fast one. I'm not sure if you're able to see the difference. Oh, gets grabbed out of the, the reversal. The tick throw game really finding purchase here for Death Monk. Oh, good EXCP. I don't, I don't hate that. No. Oh, excellent! Oh, you love that! No punish! Oh, doesn't cash oh, out! It's okay, it's oh. okay. This, is, this has been a, a fascinating set so far. A counterweight, like, really doing 85% of each. Like, he's he is right there on every single one. Right. The tiniest of adaptations of this goes the other way. Oh, good crush counter there by counterweight. Classic oh, EXP comes out from that punk. Oh, what a parry on the on the heavy stomp there! Great option from Counterweight. One of one of Counterweight's strengths as a player, dude's unflappable. Just like super, super chill. Much like this character. Oh, this is gonna be big damage from the Death Monk here. Oh, gets a counter here. Gets a reset. Oh, wait. Stun's a bit of a threat here. Watch out! You have to hold up there. Oh, oh that's probably gonna kill. That'll yeah. That'll do her. That'll do her. Yep. Hot dog. Def Monk trying to keep this momentum Kage sprinting wins. through this first attempt so far. He has some really nasty setups with that demon too. We saw it at the end of the first game there where he just kind of crossed it really fast for basically a reaction check. That was insane. What would you say is the adaptation the Counterweight needs? Because he's, he's doing so much of what he needs. Uh, I'd say it's just the air game. Um, we're seeing it Right from the very start of this round, we see uh, Death Monk already approaching the uh, cross-up, right? Uh, as long as you can, you know, kind of space yourself properly to make sure you kind of avoid cross-ups, right? Make sure you get those anti airs consistent. I think that's the one thing that counterweight's missing. But so far, this offense from Death Monk is really impressive. Sweep for a sweep. Oh, there's the overhead. Yeah, this is really hard to commentate because it's such an incredible fast-paced set. It's just oh, yeah. sprinting They're along. Oh yeah, they slugging it out. 
I feel like Devmonk has really varied his tactics. He's done staggered buttons, he's done tick throws, he's done quite an abusive little series of game three, which is not to disparage him, that's part of fighting. Catch the deal, Red. DP. Oh, good air to air. Good counter hit there, yeah. Too. Scary to jump against Death Mode right now. Oh, good conversion. That's nice. Oh. oh, here we go. Party time. Oh, that's big damage there. Yes. Just what we need. If we oh. are counterweight. Oh. I think he's going to go for DP. Good stuff there by counterweight. But much like Lambit Pinwheel yesterday, really great spacing on the old Hadouken. Final round. Fight. What a jump in! Oh yeah. Oh, oh. Still gets to punish it. Good DP there. Oh, the throw, that's stun. Right Won't combo kills here. Enough. Kage has like Won't no help. Quite enough. Oh my oh, god! I'm wrong. <laughs> I'm wrong. Clip it. Put it in the file of Papturd inaccuracies. P V seven golden letters counterweight in style. Run it. I think that's a new addition you got from the recent uh, season update. Uh, is EX talks into EXDP there? Uh, I could be mistaken, but that was sick. Oh, you know how I know I love fighting games? I have actual goosebumps. <laughs> that was so, so hype. That was sick as hell. King shit indeed. King shit indeed. Oh, that's a tar gobble. I think I think if uh, Counterweight realizes uh, that he can punish that sequence on block. Oh, he's gonna get a lot more damage out of his interactions. I don't hate Universal. that. I don't. I like that too. I don't want to hold this crap in the corner against Kage. Too scary. Oh no, that's oh. a big read there. Good read there by Death Monk. Really good corner control here. Goes for the cross up. He loses the corner control. Street Fighter Five. We take the throw. That was the minus version. Man. Man, Counterweight has some of the jump timing on those air fireballs. That's going to be an absolute difference maker in the set if he can keep that consistent. It's kind of an interesting change in the pacing. Like, we're seeing a slight slowdown mm -hmm. um, insofar as, like, the DPs and the willy-nilly sending it. That block from Death Monk was huge. That's going to... Okay, no pressure found so far. Good parry. Oh, that was on the, on the medium one, too. That wasn't even the slow uh, stomp. I am, I am a hype fan of the counterweight parries and those confirms. Very consistent for both moves. Excellent. Oh, what a read there by counterweight. This is going to hurt. Speaking of... Will we see another one from Death Punk? No, no, no. Oh, gets the meaty stomp. Me or you will die. Okay, he crosses over. And now you're in the corner, Watch sir. out. De uh, Demon is a real threat now. Yep. CA on deck. Oh, you know what I think was going on there? I think he was trying to get his demon out, but didn't quite get it. That's why he was whipping those buttons. Good. You know what's going on there? Stripe the mutes and with Prime. Thank you, brother. We love you. And right back to it. Jumps in with a Tatsu. Big loot to the head. All these fires in this field of grass doesn't feel terribly safe. Counterweight not feeling very safe these throws. Oh, just a little oh, early. for the parry. Yeah, there it is. Astra in the chat. Thank you for the sub. We love you, Astra. We also love big-ass conversions. Oh, yeah. Oh. I, I'm seeing a lack of uh, anti airs from Counterweight here. I was going to say, we both saw the same DP. But you know what? It just was a little bit it was a little late. It just came out right now. Bonk. Bonk. Oh. Shit. Oh, no. Oh, oh just yeah. a tad late. As per always, to explain my cheering, I cheer for the person you behind because I want a 9 to 9 set forever. Right. Big subs in the chat. Love the community. Thank you all for turning out, as always. FGCB would not be what it is without you. You mind commentating by yourself real quick? I need a potty break. <laughs> oh, I'm used to it, bro. No problem. Give me a second. <laughs> I'll see you in a few. Round one. Fight. We are underway. Jumps the red fireball. Solid read. Unfortunately, doesn't confirm and will pay. Kage stomps and stomps. Takes that pressure. Throw after dash is fake. Calls it out. The DP for his troubles. Oh. 
jumps over the EX Fireball. This pressure, the punish is saying, gets caught on the B-Shift, small punish, stun looming large for counterweight. Bar face down. We're back to full screen. And hair still very pivotal right here. But just walks up. It's started. You see the parry? Nope, overhead. Man, I feel like one thing Death Punk is doing incredibly well is he's spicing up his options, keeping it very hard to stay awake. He had that little uh, two low lights earlier, but other than that, there has been like nothing, no semblance of a pattern. Counterweight figuring it out live on the scramble as we go. Wow, classic Ryu play. Fireball jump right into it, I'm waiting. Falls into a nice little cover. Counterweight kicks the screen real estate, gets caught on the dash with the DP. We got some Street Fighter 6 sweeps out here now. It's a poke tool again, my friend. Another great confirmed counterweight's like he's fucked. This guy's a shame. Have I missed anything, Pat? Just some sick confirms. Ooh, cross up. Now you're in the corner. Activates. All the DA looking large. Right here. Keeps one bar of that meter for the reversal should he need it. Here it hold comes. Hold up, hold up. Jump. Yep. Counterweight says, You got me with two of those, bro. No. Stop. Two please. is enough. Final yes, counterweight coming from the spooky school of thought. We do optimal conversions. We do the most amount of damage. My tournament combo and my regular combo are the same. Minus two after that medium stomp there. Um, Death Punk in a really good position to keep this core control. Oh, but counterweight finding a way out. Oh, what a oh, cross oh, up. Oh, oh. Counterweight finds himself having corner control now. Back to mid screen. Oh, the this cross cut! Great cross cut. We love the cross cut. We punish sweep with sweep. Oh, what a jump! I thought I was gonna punish for a second. Saw the counter there. Oh, there's Fresh the overhead counterweight, dude. That's a big air to air. That's a huge air to air. Oh, you can punish that. Activates. Oh, just too many parries. Oh no. Good stuff there by Def Wait, One had it in his hands. One thing to remember about this matchup, and this is for any Shoto really, if they EXTP into activate, they are minus six. So you can punish them for their uh, for their wrong activation route. Yeah, when we say keeps it safe on that particular cancel, it's like safe with a wink and a nod. Yeah. Right. Spooky calling me out of the chat. That's a good point. Oh, what a that's cross! A spooky challenge. Oh, what a what a yeah. drop! That's gonna hurt. Oop! Favor for favor. Let's jump the hook. Nice DP. I really feel like if Counterweight can consistently anti these, he's gonna be in a great position. No, yeah, I agree. Oh! Oh, what a DP there by Death Monk. Scary. Oh, the four fears oh. connects, but doesn't get the follow up though. That is yeah. minus two. Be that was a good DP. That was a I don't, great I don't hate that. Oh, the cross up gets a counterweight again there. Looking for that EX foot. Oh no, it's my turn though, don't you see? Takes the space. I don't want to guess it. Oh, good fire the fireball. There. We're in my hole. Oh, the okay, cross likely change. He's dead. Oh yeah, that'll do it. Wow, wow, magic pixel round again. These two are evenly matched. Shout out to the Kuma, by the way, who said that these should be the matches we play. We were looking for first chance people who might have a good set. This was nominated, and obviously we see why. Big oh. chase down there, keeping the open. Oh, that stuns the threat, yeah. This is gonna hurt. No meter to that work stuns with, more but than a threat. Yeah. It's it's a promise. Death Monk trying to fight his way out of the corner here. Oh good cross up there by Death Monk. Oh, just Five bars the throw. The dream. And Jesus, that throw did a lot of damage. Horror. Well, it did a <laughs> yeah. I was gonna say it did a lot of damage to Kage. Yeah. <laughs> bones are made of, of the bones of birds, carefully reassembled in human form. Wow! This shit is insane! I know, right? <laughs> They're swinging! What a blast! They, they are, are swinging. swinging! Anybody here is like a super old head in the UFC? Forrest Griffin? Steven Bonner? Similar vibes. Oh, 
Oh, a what a crosscut. I love seeing that. Lord, he's an old head. Oh, I don't hate that We option. catch dive kicks. Yeah. We catch dive kicks. Let's go. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta appreciate just the resolve to counterweight here. Oh, yeah. Oh. That Def Monk offense at first, bro. I was panicking. Harry. Oh! 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 He delayed it. That was an excellent offensive round there from Counterweight. Good. These two are incredibly evenly matched. We'll see how Def Monk uh, starts to adapt here. Def Monk is a very cerebral player. Um, I remember he was talking to me about Street Fighter early on when he was learning this game. Like he was figuring out day one, like off of this stuff. Very smart. Mm -hmm. Blocked across this time. Good defense. Stun, moving large. Activates. Oh, will that hit? This isn't real. This isn't real. Oh, not quite the punish he wanted. This is, this is looking pretty good for Def Punk here. He has corner control, has the offensive pressure. No meter here from Counterweight now. Oh, that's the minus one? Minus? Walking up, gets caught for his toes. Tree, that's the play. I totally agree with that player. They're definitely going to win. This is real power. Final round. Fight. Oh, misses the, the cross cut there. Good combo there by Death Punk. Has corner control now. Ooh, just lets it rip. Cross up. Oh, that's done. Counter hit. I don't I don't think this next couple is gonna kill. Too much scale no. at this point. That said, a little American reset will do ya. Activates. Oh, just jumps her into the oh. air fireball. And Death Punk is closing it out. His, his ability to control space with the air fireball has been Kage just wins. such a menace oh, yeah. in this game. I think it's been a tale so far, mostly of counterweight on defense, kind of like a counter striker, counter puncher. Mm -hmm. um, whereas Death Monk is just, he cannot wait. He's got that cammy player energy. Go and get one. in, build a house on your lawn. Fight. Oh. Early button on the jump in. Good last second tech there. I love I'm loving the control from Death Monk right now. In neutral. I was gonna say, I was gonna say he's really insisting counterweight be patient, because if you don't, goes for the shimmy, gets it, but didn't quite get the punish. Good sweep for a sweep. Oh that, there it is. I wanna see more of that. I wanna see more recognition of the uh, heavy stomp. That DP was the. I was gonna say that was a. That was a. I don't. I don't want to wait it. I need this time. I need this time. <laughs> Counterweight's patient play style has been. It's honestly inspiring. Like the man has. He's got the patience. To Put on the brakes. Death Mug drank the game with you, though. He's out. Here. He's oh, pressed. Yeah. He's playing. Oh. No sleep punish. Pookie, that's correct. We've done a first to five before, like an honorary one. But the first to ten. Big damage. Good conversion off the super. I love Kage combos, dude. Good cross cut. You know what? One thing I oh. do appreciate about uh, Counterweight is even though he's failed a few of these uh, cross cuts, he's still, in, you know, con you know, he's still trying to do it. Like he's not deterred from yes. doing it. Yes. We keep that option in the deck. Sacco, you are correct. He can do a neutral jump um, in the middle of TP for a jumping punish, but it's a lot of effort. I feel like right now, you do your tournament combos, whatever you can count on. Patience, oh, man. man. Watch your toes, watch your oh, toes. That oh, catches him! Catches that him! That was huge! All Ghost Rider. You the win. poet. Yes. Unstoppable force, immovable object. Absolutely. Yeah, super good jump. Super good jump. And I apologize to me for cutting you off. This is just so hype. I know. I was gonna say, all seemed good for Def Monk there. Like that was gonna be his round, and all of a sudden, just the right jump at the right time did it for Counterweight. Man, what a set! What an absolute treat! Fight! 
have been we have been privileged with Ryu gameplay yesterday and today. Oh yeah. Cross under. Oh. He waited there, I think, for Yuji not to come. Harry gets caught. Doesn't turn off the light. Check them toes. Toe no inspector. Open up. Oh! Golly, the air fireball. Oh, yeah. I've, I've never understood that on this character as an option until today. Like, I see it. No, yeah, it's a really good way to control the neutral. Um, especially if you have the instant air fireball. This round has been a phenomenal out of pick. Oh, yeah. They figured out what wasn't working from him. It's changed. Slow way down. I think options give me a little bit more versatility. I'm a little bit less hard. You're damn right, Spooky. Cross cut. Like, this man, this man has that locked in. Holy cow. Oh. Big damn. Listen to the T and counterweight. The T and death mark. Got like a long name. <laughs> stomp, stomp, stomp. Minus. Oh, yeah, I, yeah, I feel like your point there, calling out that minus is important because I yeah. feel like if you do not know the gaps in Kage, it does not seem like there are any. He is just an endless fountain of punch. This is this is doable for counterweight here. Oh, be reversal, be reversal, fight! Oh, the punish! Oh, the beating! Yes. Is this real? Oh my god! No bar, no bar, no bar! That's real! Oh my god! <laughs> What a oh, turn of events for Counterweight! Oh my god! Oh my god! The man is made of steel! Ice in his veins! That's Goosebumps number two of the day! <laughs> Holy shit! Jesus. Oh no! Oh. Doesn't get the punish though. No punish. And you thank your lucky stars in that one second you have to breathe in those settings. That's plus there. Oh! Carries the wrong move, but still gets something out of it though. Death on the defense here. What's going to be his play here? Stun. Fade. Oh, good. oh, it was excellent pressure until Counterweight just let it rip. Oh, this could be good for Death Monk here. He has Demon available to him now. A, a, a single reset here, and Counterweight is screwed. Oh, no! Doesn't get the Demon reset. Counterweight oh. steals it. And the set you narrows win. closer. This is fire. <laughs> Holy this smokes. This is dream. <laughs> this is crazy. Our... These parries, dude. I feel like, um, I said, I think I said the same thing about Devmunk earlier. But Counterweight doing a phenomenal job of burying his options here a little mm -hmm. bit. No, yeah. Um, like, he's, he's thrown two mid enemy string EXDPs, like, just enough to keep it effective without going, hey, okay, I'm committed to this. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Oh, good chase down by Death Monk there. Stun's gonna be looming here. Oh, what a parry. Goes for the air, oh, to air. air to air. Not a bad option. I was thinking he was gonna get EXDP when he landed. For a second, I thought so, she too. a lot. Good, good, good DP, anti-air. Oh, that jump is gonna Ooh. hurt. That's huge. I didn't even know Ryu can do that. I was gonna say, we're all learning today, my friend. Close life, close life, slight. Oh, activates to keep it. Oh, goes for the uh, Crouch Pierce instead of the DP. Oh, that might be Death Monk's game now. I think if he converts it. Oh, get Oh, the meaty. Death Monk with the little side switches. Mad cute. That is a respectful term. I love the little side switches. I'm really loving this base control when uh, Death, uh, Death Monk's in neutral with the air fireball into the red fireball. I agree. What a conversion here. That's gonna hurt. Now, we've learned better than to count counterweight out. Ooh, the fake side switch! You're nasty, Death Monk! Oh, oh that's... I don't wanna hold this. <laughs> that's done. Yeah, that's... The right combo's gonna do it. Oh, that's gonna hurt! Counterweight willing to spend it here. This match on the match with the round and this particular game on the line. Defmon taking that next game. Kage wins. Defmon three games away, but Counterweight's still not far behind. Yeah, that's true.
it's been very back and forth. I feel like Def Monk is having an experience uh, very much like one I had against Bobby the other week, where I was very grateful for that lead because after your opponent makes the adaptation, you are on a clock. Round one. Fight. Anime fireballs flashing. Oh yeah. Good DP there by Def Monk. I Lovely. feel that's something that we haven't seen too much from uh, Def Monk's uh, side either. To be fair, we've mostly seen Def Monk's air fireballs keeping counterweight out. And these parries keeping him in. Love the throw, keep it an option. Never stop throwing, catch him with the jab. I'll trust you. Oh! Dash yeah, finds there, purchase. Yeah. Oh, that cross-up is gonna hurt. That might be stunned there. That might be. That might be. Oh, no. oh, that will do it. That will do yep. it. There's a lot of scaling. He'll need to kill Super here if he wants the kill. Oh, wait. Excuse me. Maybe or, not. Oh, or we underestimated Tax Oh, my God. I thought the scaling Hot was gonna dog. save him. Man. And now he goes into this round with that full stick of bombs. Minus. Yo, Thacko speaking some truth. Depth, depth love. Minus. Oh, that's gonna oh. hurt. That's gonna hurt a lot. Oh, goes for the QQ the reset. reset. Oh, oh, the EX air toxic. You're nasty. You're disgusting. Oh my god. Oh, dude, dude, dude. Like, one of my favorite parts of FGCB lately oh, is occasionally at like 2 in the morning, I get a DM from Def Monk. He's like, bro. Look at this mix. <laughs> it's like a 35 second clip of him just annihilating this trading dummy's soul. And now we're seeing it pay off. Lab time pays off, my friend. Oh yeah, absolutely. Round one. Fight. Counterweight needs to rally. Got a little bit of room still here. The, the, the popular phrase the youths are using is let them cook. We do not want Death Monk to cook if we're in the counterweight camp right now. Good air to air there. Into the throw. Stun bar at half. 50%, but all the way down now. That's that minus. Air. Plus. Yo, I like Loki. Appreciate you saying that so much. Because <laughs> I, I literally am guessing stuff to this day. Minus, well, he got hit. So yeah, it's the slow wind-up one that's the plus one. Oh! Oh, saves his BB, or excuse me, saves his super to not go uh, into demon, just goes for the throw instead. I was schmixed. Good offense here but from Death Monk. Oh, what a cross cut! Tables have turned now! Wait a second, Devon doing a really good job at sliding out of this corner. I love the cross cut DPs in this game. Oh, that Fierce is going to do a ton of damage. Damn, Spooky dropping knowledge. Ya is plus, and Cha is minus. I, my tiny brain will never hold this, but thank you. That's actually super useful. Cool. Oh, uh, hold up! Oh, that's going to kill. All right, anybody who wants a long set, which is everyone, channel your energy. Channel your energy to the sky. Flow it directly into counterweight into his parrying muscles. Also, I should learn how to close out a pull because at some point we're gonna need to know that. Round one, fight. Parries the fireball. Sweep, nothing to cancel into. He's a sweep for his trouble. Get in the corner. Do oh, super cross deep cross up. up. Yeah. Oh, stun. Stun. Stun's a real threat, but wait. Def Funk avoiding Not it. Anymore. Still at 50% stun. The latest. The latest and greatest. The cross up DPs gets caught with the meaty. This is exactly what Def wanted to happen to you. Ooh, the patience. I think he was baiting the DP. Oh, yeah. Def Punk one round away. Round two. Fight. 
here we are. Counterweight trying to pick up a little bit of momentum to keep this thing alive. Channel four. Oh, not quite enough. Oh, wow. I don't think he meant to do that, actually. I think he was trying to do an EXCP. That ends up working out for him, though. Stunned speechless. He can barely talk. Oh! 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 He's got the Kuma's quotes for our next competitor. Stay tuned, but not just yet, because Counterweight ain't going away. Good tech. Brave tech. Air to air keeps him there. Oh my god. But that DP. That's Ryu, man. That's Ryu's you subtle chill energy. Good. Four. Yosh! Six to nine. The set is fine. Can Counterweight keep this momentum? Can he keep it pushing forward? Round one. Clash of Fireballs doesn't get the anti-air from Death Punk. Death Punk really milking that low. Ooh, what a whip punch there. Great patience from Counterweight here. He can take a shot at some point. Oh, good pressure by Death Punk, yeah. That's Returning a favor from guaranteed. earlier, yep. Yeah. And now, on his back foot again, is Counterweight. He's staved off the Reaper a couple of times. That Tatsu. Oh, here we are. Oh, I'm not even playing, bro. I'm not even playing with you. Big jump in, a little hair late for the punter. Oh, he's splitting a rip. Oh, unfortunate Minus. Parry. I kind of like that dude, Virgil, actually. Get him, get him back there. Plus. You see Counterweight really, really enjoying a certain spacing on the screen, trying to facilitate that, give himself a little bit of room. I don't want to go to Def Monk's Funhouse and guessing. Oh, oh, no. No. oh, doesn't get the full punish Oh, off. spared! Watch the demon! Counterweight has a bar! That's gonna catch the beer reversal! Will this kill? Not quite! Nope! Still in it! Oh, <gasps> that EX Fireball doesn't do <gasps> it! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, the air Fireball! <laughs> Catches him! Oh. With the jump my in. God. Wow, D Dow! Wow! Wow! What a set from these fine competitors. That was phenomenal. It's go time. Jesus. Death Monk taking it. What? Good stuff to both these players. That was a fun set to watch. It was a great set to watch. That was a phenomenal set to watch. All we gotta do is my dumbass has to figure out how to deal with channel points. <laughs> Great, great stuff from both competitors. Six to ten is a respectable showing from all sides. I felt like for a while their counterweight had had just solved the Rubik's Cube that is Death Punk. But unfortunately, well for him, pretty sick for Death Punk. Uh, Death Monk got that pressure rolling in just so much value. I think if counterweight could have just like just three or four of those conversions back, man, he would be probably a couple of games ahead. Good stuff. Oh yeah, absolutely. I think. Uh... The aggressive nature from Death Monk really uh, gave Counterweight a tough time at the beginning. Counterweight was adapting, uh, but it's just unfortunately it was just not uh, quick enough. And it happens. It happens.